You're such an asshole. Hello, Lieutenant of the Counter Seal Captain here, and fresh out of the shower. Free shirt. My buddy Richard bought two shirts. Way too small for him, but perfect size for me. Free good. Free is good. Hello, asshole. I'm currently 21. I'm in a university straight out of high school where my tuition is covered because of my scholarships. I work part-time and go to school full-time to pay for my... You go to school... Oh, you work part-time. Okay, I was about to say. You, you get full scholarships and you're working full-time. You work part-time and go to school full-time to pay for my expenses and help out my dad with the rent. I was a kinesiology major, but then I realized I was a shit major. Very good man. Everything fucking common sense. Then I switched to nursing, but then after I... But then when I realized this shit is fucked up with all the nonsense with the professors not don't teaching shit, I mean not teaching shit, this is what they usually say. Okay, guys, in class we will discuss the main things of the subject, but when you guys read the 30 chapter per exam, it'll make sense. <laughs> ah, academia. And then I'm like, fuck this shit. Why am I going through all this for... I don't even like nursing. I was there mainly because of the good job prospects, then went back to check out the business school. After I realized this shit is fucking common sense, the only thing worth getting is accounting, which I'm good at, but it's fucking boring. All right, stop right here. I could, I could, I can feel this. I could sense you, dude. You're like, dude, that sucks, and that sucks. That all of it sucks. It all sucks. You have a choice. You could do the shit that sucks that pays a lot, or you could do the shit that kind of seems like it doesn't suck, but oh, trust you me, it will suck in the end and doesn't pay a lot. Stop it with this trying to find a me Stop being a chick. Stop being a suburbanite spoiled princess. We I'm going to work in a job, and it's going to pay. It's going to be wonderful. I'll be, be worrying, and I'll have coffee with my friends at work. No. All jobs. All professions suck. The choice that you get to make is whether or not you want to be paid a lot of money. That's it. So this huge gargantuan lie that your teachers, who never worked in the real world anyway, and your parents, who don't want to hurt your feelings, lie, told you to so there be hope in the future go on in life, that here's your job and it's rewarding and it's great, is it? No. All jobs are boring. The ones that pay more are even more boring. And you either accept you're going to embrace the suck and make a lot of money and work hard at it, or you could do what two-thirds of American college students do, uh, a disproportionate number of them women, and that is follow your heart and the money will follow. And then it's a life of fucking hell and costs you more calories of energy than if you just majored in fucking engineering the first time around instead of majoring, oh, I gotta get this education degree, then I gotta get a master's, then I gotta get a certification, I gotta do this, I gotta do that, I gotta do that. And then all of a sudden you're 50 and then maybe, maybe you're making over 60 grand a year and you still have student loans left over. All right? You want it to be boring. You want it to suck because you are going to embrace the suck. All right? So stop. Well, that sucks too. That sucks. Man. Wait, I want to just have my dick blown and get paid 100 bucks. Okay, go be a porn star. That might be one thing you could do that doesn't suck. <laughs> it does. But dude, yeah. Accounting is boring. Uh, IT is boring, engineering is boring, chemistry is boring, uh, programming is boring, it's all boring. That's why you're paid an ass load of money for it. All right? So I'll continue on. Not to mention all the things you have to do to get the CPA, not to mention I have a 50% passing rate, you need a master's, and you still need to educate yourself as you pass it. Finally, I realized I have gone three years of college without choosing one thing. Yeah, because you keep fucking around thinking that it's going to be like, oh my god, dick, get my dick suddy, suck degree. I got my bachelor's in a woman sucking my dick. Oh, it's great. I get paid $50,000 in benefits and insurance and now tuition me, but I'll get my master's in girls sucking my dick. And then I can go and work at the, at the Elite Studios in L.A. or wherever they fucking film porn. Uh, at least I have all the basics out of the way. I always think I should try calculus one or two during the summer to test if I can do engineering, quit my university, go to community college to get the rest of the pre-engineer courses there and transfer to a decent school a year later. That sounds like a good idea, <clears throat> which will take me about six years to get a bachelor's and around seven thousand, ten thousand in student loans. Well, that's nothing. Maybe less because of the scholarships. I can easy... I can easy get with my CP GPA. 
I want to hear your advice on what to pursue, which engineering made the best. I was thinking computer engineering or civil or just stay in accounting, which is horrible and boring. Not to mention all the useless theory classes they make you take, like marketing and human resources. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah the, 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 I'd say fuck business school. Or apply for the Border Patrol and Customs. That's not bad. That's another idea you could do. That's, that's okay, which is something common in here, but it also takes about a year for the background check and all the exams. Yeah, you can put in your application now. And it's the government, man. It's going to take fucking forever. I know it was a good paying career. It's just I'm afraid to get killed in a Mexican board. Well, that's what, again, you watch too much TV thinking that I, I, I understand what, or I hope people understand that when I recommend people join the military, they know there's a chance you'll get shot. Yeah, that's why you paid. That's why cops get paid a little bit more and they get to retire early. So, yes, there is a risk you might get killed at the Mexican border. So if you're worried about that, don't join Customs or, or Border Patrol. Let me know what you think is the best. Take care, asshole. Finally, if I do go the engineering round, I'll see all my friends graduate before me. Fuck it. Who gives a shit? So what? What? Majoring in English? Majoring in, in uh, uh, literature? Majoring in sculpture? There, it's, the, the goal... You're not here to win the war at 22. Or 23 or 24 or 25. You're... You don't really figure out who's winning in life until you're in your mid to late 30s. That's where all of a sudden it's like your parents finally cut you off. You, you don't get no more fucking government cheese. And, and then you start to lose your looks. Like it really becomes clear who has their fucking shit together after 35. All right. So you're not here to win the 20s war. And besides which, I know everyone in their 20s, I know a lot of people, if they're, I know a lot of people until they're dead, they will borrow money to make it look like they're rich and they're all living fucking paycheck to paycheck. Don't do that. Don't fall for that fucking bullshit. All right? This is not a race. What is it? A race to get a worthless degree and be in debt. Congratulations, two-thirds of America. You guys fucking won the race. I know it's not a race, but fuck, man. Six years for a bachelor's. Yeah! Yeah, because you fucked up. Admit it, you fucked up. You went to college when you didn't know what you wanted to study. You're, you're, this, this stuff should have been done at the age of 17. This is why I wrote Reconnaissance Man and Worthless. This is why every fucking high schooler has to do. But now it's too, you're going to waste at least a year or two now. All right. <clears throat> uh, I, I want to know why your dad was... You were paying him rent. Well, my dad told me his dad started charging rent... At the moment he became 18. Good man, good man. So he did the same to me. I pay 160 a minute. Oh, that's not 40 for electricity. There you go. You're half a man now. You're still living at home. That's heavily discounted rent. Um, I forgot to mention I have more of an inclination for civil rather than computer engineering. All right, look, dude. It's not going to cost you anything to file an application with the border guard. So that's something you could do now. And in a year from now, you know, you worry about that. So throw that seed into the soil and hopefully it'll sprout in a year. So that's one thing to do. And nothing says you have to follow up on it. I, I remember I applied for the reserve cops uh, in my town. And I, I think it took them nine months to get back to me. I'm like, dude, nine months, times have changed. And they're like, oh, yeah, we're really interested. And I'm like, what, now? <laughs> it's like, I thought you guys are so desperate. You had like, oh, you're really short staff. You're short staff for nine months? Fuck you. Get the fuck out of here. Um, so do that. And then I'm gonna, it's the ballpark, dude. You're in the ballpark. I can't tell you what field of engineering to go into. The benefit, though, of being smart and wise and being in STEM and majoring in wise subjects, or at least acknowledging that, is you get to choose between these wise subjects that is of interest to you. I know accounting is boring. Maybe that's not for you. But if you think you're leaning towards civil, perfectly fine. Or maybe you lean towards mechanical, perfectly fine. Doesn't matter as long as you're in the ballpark and you're in the ballpark. I'd avoid the bioengineering, though. I'd avoid biology, I'd avoid straight up chemistry degrees, straight up physics degrees, it has to have engineering at the end of it. Um, but yeah, dude, you're in the ballpark. You, it's kind of whatever you want now, as long as there's a job at the end attached to it. So I would say in your case, civil engineering, go back to uh, community college, get your engineering prereqs out of it. And when you find out the calculus is boring, don't fool oh, me, it's fucking boring, man, fuck it. Because then you will be like 37 with 20 years of fucking college classes and no fucking degree because you've tried every possible STEM major and they're all boring. Yes, yes, you're going to take boring classes. Yes, some of them are not only going to be boring, they're going to be tougher than fuck. Knock it off with the whining and push through it. 
All right, that's all we got. You guys got questions. The old captain's got answers. Assholeconsulting.com. Read my book, Worthless. That would that would have saved this young man a lot of pain and agony. It could save you a lot of pain and agony. Check out the podcast, the Clary Podcast, and give me even more money through patreon.com slash Aaron Clary, and then go to my blog, CaptainCapitalism.blogspot.com. We'll see you guys later. Toodles.